really quick before we start the video, I just wanted to let you guys know that I didn't do any editing in here because I wanted it to feel more like a conversation I was having with you guys and not like all jump cutty and stuff because sometimes that can disconnect you from what I'm trying to say. So hope you enjoy the video. And as always, love you guys. Peace. What is up, everybody? It is Gristle. I am here because I got to tell you something that's fucking nuts. I'm fucking, I turned 40 years old today. How fucking crazy is that? Like, I remember back in my 20s, I was like, 40 fucking years old, man, you're old. I always thought that was a fucking old age, and I don't even know, I don't even know why, but it just seemed old to me. I guess because I was in my 20s, it was almost like double me, you know what I mean? But... The funny thing is, is now that I'm here, which that's another funny thing. I never thought I'd make it to 40. Why? I have no fucking clue. I didn't think, I didn't, I don't know if I thought I was going to die or I just couldn't fathom being 40. I don't know what it was, but I just never thought I would be 40. And so now that that day is here, it's weird to me because it doesn't feel the way I thought it would feel because I'm not I'm not different in any way. I'm still I'm still a kid, if that makes any sense. I mean I I probably look old, I don't know. I can't can't really tell. When you see your face over and over, you really don't tell how much you're aging. So I don't know. I don't know if I look forty, I don't know. But I sure as hell don't feel forty. I mean, granted, there are times I, I'm sore as fuck. Uh, like if I do something, like I'm way sore than I used to be when I was a kid. But that's the thing is like, I think I attribute to that, um, that to, uh, I never really wanted to stop being a kid and I haven't really ever stopped being a kid. I mean, there's some adult features that have kind of seeped into my life, you know, and it's inevitable as you're getting older, you know, you got to learn how to live on your own. You got to pay your own bills. You got to do all this other stuff. But I always told myself I wasn't going to let that change who I was because I never wanted to grow up. (laughs) I never wanted, I always, I thought it was weird because I always thought there was going to be some age where something clicked and all of a sudden I'm an adult. I'm glad it never happened because I don't, and I see all my other friends you know, that I knew in school, I don't see him a lot, but I see him on Facebook and stuff and holy shit, have they aged? Holy fuck. They are fuck. God damn. Some of them partied hard and it shows when they were younger. But, um, that was mean. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to be that mean, but, uh, no, some of them, they're like so adult and I almost feel sorry for them. You know what I mean? Because it was it's fun to still have that young feeling in your brain. You know what I mean? I still think like a kid. Some goofy shit. Like, you remember, I don't know, when I was a kid, I could look at stuff and just imagine. Uh, imagine. I mean... Imagination would run wild as a kid. I didn't have internet back when I was a kid, so you had to make do with what you had and make your own imaginary things and just kind of imagine stuff. And I remember back when I was a kid, when parents would drive me around in the cars and stuff, you know, I'd see a field and I'd imagine shit in the field and be like, oh, that'd be cool to do this and do that. I still do that shit as an adult, as a 40 year old man. You know, when I'm driving somewhere and I see a just a cool fucking whatever. I imagine stuff with that and I'm just like, man, that would be fucking, that'd be sweet. I play video, well, I haven't been playing video games much lately because I'm busy kind of running my own business right now, but like video games, it, it, it's a huge part of my life. Like I'm seeing this new stuff with World of Warcraft coming out and I'm, I'm, I've got an urge to play again. But right now I'm busy building my business and so I really don't have that time to do that. But once I get that, you know, foothold in with my business, you know, I'm going to be back on video games because video games is something special to me. 
I like it and I'm fucking 40. I guess what I'm telling you guys is don't fucking grow up. Don't think that you have to be a grown up. No matter what your age is. No matter if you're 40, 50, 60, whatever. You don't have to automatically click and be an adult. Because I think I think that's what makes people so depressed and how they age. Like I told you, those people on Facebook, you know what I mean? They are the same age as me, but they look like hell. I mean, in the nicest way. I don't know how that could be nice, but I'm just saying, they look like hell. And I think it's because they've decided to make that switch and become an adult. They they quit having fun. I mean, you might see them on vacation and stuff like that, but it's still the stress of being an adult is creeping up on them and, and they can't, you can just see it in them. And I don't know, I just, I, I just can't see a life, I don't like to stress about stuff too much. My mom, my mom makes fun of me sometimes about, I mean, not really make fun of me, but she jokes with me sometimes about it. She's like, you know, talks about how mellow I am as far as like, not responsibilities, but like stuff that she would worry about or, you know, other people would worry about. I'm just like, eh, okay, yeah, I'll get to it. And it's not that I'm prolonging something or, or trying to put something off. It's just, I don't really care about it. Because in the long run, in the in the scheme of life, that shit don't matter. What matters is you enjoy yourself. You know, I'm at forty, so I'm at the halfway point of my life. You know, and in about thirty-five to forty more years, I'm, you know, I'm gonna be probably having my daughters, you know, doing their best to help take care of me if I'm in a nursing home when I'm eighty or something. And so these last 40 years of my life, I've really got to make it count because the first 40 years, yeah, you know, when you're growing and you get to your 20s and mid 20s, you're fucking just partying and having fun and doing whatever. And then so from that 25 to now 40 mark, you know, I kind of didn't do shit with my life. And what I mean by that is, is I... I put up with a job because I thought it's what I had to do. I'm sorry I'm doing this. This is annoying. And I don't know why I'm doing it. But uh, it felt like I had to do it. It was it was the predetermined thing that it's human nature. You find a job. You work at it. You work at it. You work at it. Eventually you retire. Then fucking you die. Okay. That was the way it was. And... Most of the time, 90% of the time, people hate what they're doing for at their job. I mean, at least around here. I don't know what it is like around the whole United States or the world, but there's a huge portion of people that hate what they do. And before the internet, you were kind of screwed in a way. I mean, more so than you are now. And that's what I'm saying. Like, I worked one job for 15 years and they fucking closed down. Worked another job, they shut down, worked another job, and they got slow and let people go. And that was over probably, what, 17 years, all that happened. And all those jobs, not one of them did I fucking like. Like, it wasn't a job that I was like, sweet, I love going to work every day. No, I loved the people I worked with. They were fucking cool. And yeah, I would sit there and bullshit with them and get paid. You know what I mean? I mean, I would do my job. I'm a hard worker. But I, I didn't gain anything from those jobs it was just kind of a means to an end you know and that's not fun and especially if that's what you're doing seven days a week six five six seven days a week ten hour days it's fucking bullshit you're wasting your life away in these places you know so now with the internet you know i found something inside of me that i can do and i have fun doing and there's an old saying that somebody said i don't even know who fucking said it but it's the truth that if you love, if you truly love your job, you don't work a day in your life. And that's the truth because I'm busting my ass. I'm working more hours at the job working for myself than I ever have at any job before. But I have no stress. 
I have no stress, I enjoy what I do, and honestly, I don't feel like I'm working. I feel like I'm like, holy shit, I'm making this money, and I'm having fun. Is that okay? Yeah, it's okay. It's actually what you're supposed to do. So I guess what I'm hoping to tell you guys, or maybe get through to you guys, is the internet opened up so much shit for so many people. Figure out what you want to do or what you like. Now you have to work hard at it. It's not going to be handed to you. You know, it's you're not a Kardashian to where you're gonna your whole life's laid out for you and you're gonna have all the money in the world. Now you have to bust your fucking ass. You have to bust your ass, and you have to, you know, face adversity, fall down a shit ton of times. But you got to get up, brush yourself off, and work even harder. You got to get up. You can't sleep in. You got to fucking do all this shit. But eventually, you're going to get to that point where you're like, yo, this is fucking worth it. This is fucking worth it, and I'm having a blast doing it. And that's where I am right now. And like I said, I'm, I, it just blows my mind uh, that I'm 40. And I get, you know, I guess what I hope you get out of this video is that, you know, don't settle for, you know what you're doing because you think that's what you're supposed to do in life. You do what you want to do because life is yours. It's your life that you're living. It's nobody else's. So as long as you can fucking put your nose to the grindstone and fucking bust your ass, you can do whatever the fuck you want to do in life and enjoy life however you want it, whether it be video games, movies, music, fucking paintball, I don't know what. Do whatever the fuck you want, no matter your age, no matter what the fuck. Don't grow up. Don't quit being a kid because being a kid is what keeps you young. You know, because once you click over and you're that adult, you start aging out, man. You start falling out, man, big time. And I don't ever plan to do that. I plan to die a kid. That's my plan. Whenever that death may come, I don't know, but... Even if it's like I'm 85, 90 years old. Sorry, I'm yapping too much. The camera just shut off. What I was saying is, if I live to be like 85, 90 years old, I'm still going to die a kid. I'm going to still die telling jokes. I'm going to still fucking, if I could still see, I'll still be playing video games. Hell, maybe they'll they have some weird in-the-brain virtual reality shit by that point. I don't know. But don't grow up. Do what the fuck you want to do with life. Don't listen to these naysayers out there telling you can't do it. You can do it. It just takes a lot of hard work. And But while you're having that hard work, doing that hard work, live your life. That's all I can tell you. You know, and I hope you enjoy this video. Uh, I just needed to talk about it because it just blows my fucking mind that I'm 40. So, uh, so yeah. Um... As far as future stuff on this channel, I don't know. Uh, maybe, like when I have time, I, I want to talk about stuff and maybe not necessarily reaction videos or anything like that, but who knows? I don't know, but nothing, you know, on a regular schedule anytime soon. Like if I want to turn the camera on and start talking, I'll turn the camera on and start talking. That's what a YouTube channel is about, right? You just It's your YouTube. Fucking you. I don't know. I love you guys. Peace. I really went, I really rambled at the end there.